Hey guys, welcome to My Sew Bliss. Today I'm so excited to share with you that I am the newest sewing ambassador for Baby Lock Sewing Machines. I'm so excited to go on this journey with you guys and to share some of their amazing machines with you guys. I've been sewing with Baby Lock off and on for the life of my sewing career. Um, mostly in school I sewed with them and then my mother-in-law's machine, my mom's machines. Um, just off and on, I've gone to a few um, classes and clinics for them, so I'm super excited to have one. I actually have a serger that is so nice. It does cover such stitching as well, um, but I'm excited to share with you like the sewing machines and a basic serger, and I also have um, a basic sewing machine. So if you're new at sewing, I am gonna walk you through all the tips all the tricks, all the know-how, what you need to know on using a sewing machine. But today, I'm excited to unbox this baby lock. This is the Brilliant, and this is from the Genuine Collection. The Genuine Collection is baby lock's newest um, line of sewing machines, and they have named them and made them all about how sewing and creating and crafting makes you feel the emotions that it brings out, and I am so excited about this one because I honestly do feel brilliant. I feel so like beaming and shining, and this has yellow on it, so that's even better for me, um, and I'm super excited about it. I also have the Zest. This is the Zest behind me. You can watch that unboxing video as well. I'll put a link down below for that, but let's open up the Brilliant right now. This machine is really great. If you've been sewing for a long time, you kind of want to take that next step and have a little bit nicer machine with a little bit more features on it. So I'm excited to share this one with you guys and show you what it can do because it's just so amazing and the baby lock machines are just so great. So this is going to be really fun for me and I hope it's going to be really fun for you guys too. So let's open this up. So when you open this one up, you'll see the foam all on the top. I don't even know if I can show you guys. <laughs> but it'll also have some accessories on top. You want to make sure those are set off to the side so you don't lose them. Power cord, very important. <laughs> um, also some more tools. We'll check those out in a little bit. And the manual, also very important to keep that on hand. Those are always very handy. And then again, the foam. So let's take that off. Here we go. This one comes in pieces, which is really nice because this machine is pretty heavy. Got some more foam with some stuff in it. So we're going to set this off to the side. Make sure you don't throw any of these little pieces away. Got a cover and a foot paddle. This is what makes the sewing machine go. If you've never sewn, sewn before, these are very important because that helps you sew makes it all possible. Okay, let's see if I can get this guy out. Oh, there we go. Stuck on the box. Okay. Oh, this is so exciting. Ooh. Give me my workout for the day. <laughs> Set this off to the side. Here it is. Come we got our plastic bag on it. We can take that off. They're really good about making sure it's shipped or packaged really nicely so nothing gets broken. But I am so excited about this machine. Isn't it gorgeous? Ah, oh, so excited. I like love that it's yellow, like has the yellow on it. I don't know why that makes me so happy. But if you didn't know, yellow is my favorite color, so I am all about this machine. So once you have the machine pulled out, you'll notice that there's things that are taped down. That is just for shipping purposes and for packaging purposes so that nothing's like slipping around. Um, Cause this, if I can get it, just slides right off. And then this can come off and then this will open up. So when it's shipped and packaged, they don't want that getting knocked around. Um, and broken, so they just tape those closed. So when you open it up, we can just take our tape off. <laughs> it's really hard with my nails. Ugh. But 
we'll just take those pieces off and then you can kind of just check it out. See all these cool features, what it's all about. It has a little opening right here. You can store some accessories. Let's see, take this foam piece out and really check out the machine. Oh, so excited about this. So I'm excited to share with you guys what I'm sewing on it and all the cool features it has. I think it'll be so much fun. So I have my Baby Lock Brilliant all set out, ready to start sewing with. Um, I'm gonna turn it on. On the right side of the machine, there is a switch in the back. You just flip that switch. So here has it on. We select our language, click OK, and it is all ready to sew. You can see I have the stitch width, the length, I can change the stitches, all this fun stuff that we're gonna figure out together. And then up here we have the speed control so I can make it go faster. You can see our start and stop button is highlighted. We have a cut, we have our needle down. I'm not sure what this button is, we're gonna find out. Here's our back stitch. And then we can open this up. I love how it has this on top to kind of keep it clean when I'm not using it and just kind of looks really pretty almost. So that's nice. And we can open this up and this is where all the threading is gonna happen. Up here you can see all the stitching options. That's pretty cool and really nice that it's so handy and can't get lost. Um, and then all of this is just how you're gonna thread it. So I'll create a video all about this and threading and what all the things are, but I just wanted to give you a little peek at what happens when you turn the machine on. One thing that I did wanna show you um, while I have it sitting here, I can close this now, but one thing that kind of is tricky at first is there's tape right here and it's like, okay, how do I get this off? Like these um, lift up so that you can store stuff in here. And even in the back, it has one that lifts backwards. You can store stuff back there. Really nice for storage. But one thing that you need to know is this actually comes off. So this is a whole storage compartment. Um, if you ever needed to sew, especially if sewing like cuffs, small cuffs for pants or shirts or something like, something like that, um, it's nice to take this off and be able to sew around and ha not have quite as big of a space, a sewing space. So, and that's how you get the tape off is you take this off first and then take that tape off. And then this will just slide back on and click into place so that you have a large work surface. It's really nice and handy that way. Okay, I just threaded the sewing machine and my first impressions are that it was super easy. Everything is numbered every step even like hooking it behind the needle down here is numbered um, and super friend, like user friendly. So that was really nice. And even I noticed winding the bobbin, it's numbered um, as well. So that's really nice. One of the things I like to do when I first get a machine is just take some scrap fabrics. I just like to practice sewing. I put my foot pedal down. You can see there's a start stop button and I'm just gonna sew and see how it feels. Right now it's on slow, so it's going really slow. I can speed it up a little bit, see how that feels, and kind of just play with it for a minute. And I am super excited to share with you guys all the ins and outs of this machine um, and show you the cool features, and it's just gonna be so much fun. So I hope you guys will subscribe Make sure to hit the subscribe button and also to hit the notification button so that you know when I upload a video. Um, I'll be sharing lots of tips, tricks, all about this machine and the zest and also the serger that I'm getting as well. So this is just gonna be a super fun year all about learning and growing together. So make sure to subscribe and make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching. If you wanna see more of my day-to-day -day sewing, life and all those tips and tricks you can check out my instagram at my so bliss and i will see you guys next time bye